Hey everyone, this is my channel. Hi everyone. We are doing a questions and answer uh, video. Yeah, it's a question and answer tag. Tag. <laughs> hey guys, uh, welcome Hi. to my channel. This is my friend Miriam. Hi guys. Um, she has her own YouTube channel also. Yeah, Makeup with Dolce. Makeup with Dolce. Um, so you gotta go check her out. Um, we are doing a 30 question uh, beauty tag. So we're just gonna read through and we're gonna answer them back to back, um, alternate, you know, the questions and we're both gonna answer them. So yeah. let's get right into it. Okay. First question. Do you remember your first makeup item? Coffee time. <laughs> Hold thing. Yeah, so my first beauty item was my um, squeeze tube foundation from CoverGirl. I believe so. CoverGirl. Yeah, the was. little squeeze tube, the little one. It was so cute. Yeah. yeah. Um, mine was probably the Hello Kitty um, chapstick. Nice. Yeah, and I would always steal my mom's makeup. So actually, the mascara, do you remember the one in the pink with the green um, top? Yeah. That was probably what I used to steal from her when um, I was like in eighth grade. <laughs> oh my God. Yeah. Cool. So, okay. okay. So our second question is, describe your perfect mascara and uh, have you found one that fits your specification? Yes. Um, yes, I have. <laughs> Mine yours? is the, um, Voluminous butterfly. I absolutely love it. Okay. Is that good for volume? Oh, yeah, it's great. And lengthening? Lengthening, yeah, lengthening nice. all of it. It doesn't flake. I've nice. never had an issue with that, so. Yeah, I like the L'Oreal, um, the original Voluminous. That's the one I use all the time and I love it. Yeah, though. What kind of coverage do you prefer from foundation? <laughs> Can you guess? Matte. I like full coverage. Full coverage. Yeah. yeah. I like a dewy skin finish too. I like it more dewy. I sometimes like that, but I don't like it when it looks sweaty. Yeah. I don't like that. Yeah. Um, I would have to say full coverage. Okay. Let's move on. Favorite high-end brand. What's yours? I would have to say Anastasia. Yeah, yeah I just I like love that. the palettes, mm -hmm. the eye makeup, oh my gosh, everything. Yeah, um, my favorite is MAC Cosmetics, everything. I love everything MAC, so. All right, moving on. What cosmetic brands have you always wanted to try but still haven't? Mm -hmm. Oh, I guess Louis Vuitton. Yeah, I've never, probably <laughs> the same, that. yeah. Something like that. <laughs> one day one day okay okay this is a good one do you wear fake eyelashes we talked about this in our yes. video a little bit yeah and jessica says every day i just wears. i do I every day um i'm kind of lazier and i don't do it every day but i would love to <laughs> <laughs> it just goes with my routine um, I don't feel like they're, I wear the same ones, they're wispies. I'm a mm -hmm. wispy girl, so I like that uh, Ardell. Yeah. Cool. All right. Is there any kind of makeup you can't leave the house without? Yes. Definitely concealer. Okay, so I'm not really that, but mine is gonna be... Mascara, <laughs> probably. Yeah, mascara. mascara yeah. Gotta have it. Okay, what is the most, well, what is your most Cherished beauty products. Mm. Cherished. What do I cherish right now? Huh. My my um makeup eye eyeshadow palettes. Which one? Ugh. What is your most? Well, okay. Cherished? So my most used one right now is probably the narcissist one. Um, I cherish that. Okay. About you. I cherish it all. <laughs> <laughs> I know, I, I love don't it. Know what I, I know it's so hard to choose I that. I can't pick one thing. Like this is Same. the hardest question of my life. I know. It's so hard. Because I you, I do, yeah. Um sure. if I had to pick one that I cherish, I guess. 
Your MAC eyeshadow palette. You love that. Yeah, I do love that. Okay, that's the one. <laughs> Done. Got you. <laughs> yep, you know me. Totally. Okay. Now, your turn. <laughs> How often do you shop for makeup? Do you like to pick up an item here and there or get lots of goodies at once? Oh my God. I love it all. So I go shopping all the time and I go online shopping and uh, regular shopping and Sephora, Ulta, everywhere, drugstore. So me, um, I shop for makeup every time I go into a store. Um, any kind of beauty product, I will pick it up. Um, usually there's deals and I have to get it. And then- She buys everything. Everything, yeah. <laughs> I just did a haul the other day and I had to get it all, so. Um, depends, I sometimes pick up little things here and there, sometimes I will blow a lot of money yeah. by accident. It happens. It happens. <laughs> all right, next question. Moving on, we're getting there, let's see. Do you have a beauty budget or do you spend freely? Spend freely. Spend freely. <laughs> that's a given. I, I don't know why that's a in budget. There. Who does that? Budget me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we don't need food or what clothes. Is that? Yeah, no. Just makeup. Okay. So, do you utilize coupons, reward cards, and sales when you shop for cosmetics? Yes. Yes. All the time. Every day. Every day. <laughs> <laughs> so true. Okay, your turn. Do you avoid certain ingredients in cosmetics like parabens and sulfates? Yes, definitely. We try to. Try to. Um, A lot of brands like have products that are. But they're getting better. They yeah. are getting better. Um, and I'm really into the new skincare that I, the line that I just um, started doing and. Pure it's, Haven. Yeah, Pure Haven. So great. It's taking out Her a lot of skin looks great. Yeah. After a week and a half on Wednesday, this coming Wednesday, it'll be two weeks and it's already clearing and looking. Yeah, so clear. much better. Uh, yeah. Okay. And you so. can't, This I also wanted to say, like you can't erase all toxins. Like it's just, you can't, but you might as well do what you can if you can do that, you know, with the products, the natural products, taking out um, toxins of your body. Yeah. I think it's important. It's very important. Okay, so do you have a favorite place to shop for makeup? Sephora. Sephora, Ulta. Ulta is my number one place because- I don't have Ulta near me. I don't either, but I drive really far and I go there and I love it. Where is it? <laughs> it's here. in Manchester, oh. New Hampshire, middle yeah. of nowhere. But um, they have more coupons and they have more deals. And stuff. they have a lot of 20% off deals. So check that out. And they have NYX. NYX yeah, they have Medics. drugstore and they have high end. Yep. So it's a good mix. And yep. they have hair products. So. And I love the drugstore makeups Me too. too. So I don't. Drugstore. <laughs> drugstore. <laughs> drugstore. Drugstore is killing it. Like, oh yeah, they are. They have come a long way. I'm really happy. Okay, so. Do you like trying new skincare products or do you keep a certain routine? Like I just said, I started my new skincare product. Um, and I've never had anything like it before. I didn't really have one. I always use like the Olay uh, foaming wash just to wash it away. And then I use the Garnier, um, the wet wipes after for the leftover makeup residue or. Yeah, I kind of just use the same because if I switch mine up, like I break out. So I just, I've been sticking with the same. So I just use philosophy. I used to be like that. Yeah. But when it got a little worse than- Out of control. Yeah, I was <laughs> yeah. like, I need to do something. And I just tried the all natural, organic, toxin free. So you've got to cool. check it out. All right. What is the next question, Jessica? It is favorite bath and body brand. Bath? Bath and body. What do I use? Should I go look at my bath? <laughs> I forget what I use. Oh, I use Caress Brown Sugar, I think it's called. Caress. I like the exfoliating. Is, it, is mine like the Jasmine? Um, I haven't seen it. Oh my gosh. I know it's like Caress. But it's it's exfoliating one because I like a really cleanse. Yeah, 
you know, skin. Mine is like a, I think it's called Jasmine Blossom or Japanese Blossom. Oh, yeah. Yeah. The that, black one. Oh, the pink flower. Yes. Yeah. It's I, so good. Mm -hmm. That is a good one. I like the smell of that one. Um, yeah, so that is it for that. If you could buy only one brand, what brand would you choose? Buy from one so brand. So makeup, brand? makeup. So I guess Mac. That's like a similar question as before, right? Oh, that was like our favorite, but yeah, I would only buy from Mac if I had the if I only had one brand to choose from. Yes, but I haven't really tried the foundation from Anastasia. I just love their eye makeup and their like eye pencils. They have a stick foundation, right? Anastasia, yeah. I don't know about the stick. I like Fenty. Fenty's good. All their stuff. You just choose one. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, you Tarte. Tarte's a good brand. Yeah, I like Tarte. Um, what brand do you think has the best packaging? I... Oh, so many. I like, Yuda. I like Benefit's packaging. Yeah, Benefit is good too. It's so cute. Yeah, it is but I love the corally pink. Okay, so moving on, we're almost done. Which celebrity always has great makeup? Kylie Jenner. Yeah, the Kardashians definitely. Kylie definitely. Um, I would say J Lo. I was gonna say her too. I love her. Yeah, I love her too. Yeah, she is just is always phenomenal. <sighs> so good. Okay. Her makeup is always on point. Mm -hmm. I should do an inspiration video. Inspired look. Oh my gosh, this is a good one. What is your five favorite beauty gurus? That's a oh good god, one. yeah. Uh, SMLXO. That's mine too. Steph. Love Steph. Um, and then Carly Bible. Me too. Um, wow. Nas we, have same, we have the same interest. <laughs> Nas Kavari. Duh. Um, well, so that's three of our favorites. Yep. I like Sam Ospro. I can't say her name, but Oscar, I'll link it down below, or you will, because it's your yeah. video. <laughs> She'll okay. like it. But yeah, we'll link them all, but um, I love her, because she does more lifestyle yep. videos, too. Yep. And she's so fit. <laughs> um, one more, or two more for you. Jacqueline. Jacqueline Hill. Jacqueline Hill. And I love makeup with Tiffany D, too. That's another one of my favorites. I've been watching her for years and years and years, ever since she had zero subscribers, so. Oh, wow, mm -hmm. that's awesome. Yeah, and now she has like over 900,000. Wow, she's yeah. getting right up there. That's Almost awesome. a million, yeah. yeah. So you have one more? Um. Oh my gosh, I have another one. Oh. Jordan Lipscomb. Ah, oh, perfect. I love Same. her. Same, okay. So, done. Okay. My turn. Are you clumsy in putting on makeup? <laughs> sometimes. Yeah, sometimes. sometimes. I feel like um, doing these videos, they are um, helping me pay attention a lot more and putting it on a little bit more precisely. Um, taking my time. Yeah, it makes, it makes you better. Yeah, yeah, I feel like that too. I feel like you keep improving yeah. as you're doing it, so yeah. it's awesome. Um, do you use makeup base primer for your eyes? Yes, we do. I do. You do? Yeah. I use the Urban Decay Primer Potion. What do you use? I had to use that, but I just use my eye cream now. Okay. Um, how many hair products do you use on a typical day? Like four. I I just use oil. Like products? Just products. Or like the tools? No. Products. Oh, just products. Yeah, okay. like sprays and yeah, like hairspray. One or two. Gel. Yeah. I like to go natural, so I just basically just use my oil and maybe hairspray or something like that but sometimes i'll just use coconut oil yeah just to i'll style. use oil and then i'll use um the shine spray how do you set your curls i don't hairspray? oh you don't you just let them yeah i just lose yeah okay sometimes i'll you know throw in a product to set the curl but yeah i don't really need to with the hair, so. hair style What do you apply first, concealer or foundation? What do you do? Um, I do foundation first, and then I let it set, and then I do my concealer over it, because if I do the concealer first, 
My foundation will cover the concealer. So what do you do? The opposite. <laughs> Everybody has their own like ways it's of doing so it, true. but it's fun. Yeah. Okay. But I don't use a lot of it. So, so where were we here? Okay. okay. Mm -hmm. Do you ever consider taking makeup classes? No. No? Why not? It's fun. Is it? Yeah. We should take one. We sh There's one coming up in Boston. We should go. Okay. We can make a day trip. Okay. Okay. But yeah, I, I'm so interested in that kind of stuff. I love makeup classes and <clears throat> I've taken one before, but I want more hands-on. Like, I just want more. I want to learn everything, <laughs> you know? Yeah, I guess so. That, yeah, it's a lot fun. of fun. Yeah. It's so much fun. Okay, so let's see. What do you love about makeup? That's the last question, you guys. So, what do we love about makeup? Oh my gosh, everything. You. <laughs> that was simple. <laughs> um, every, what don't, yeah, what like, don't you love? I love the way it makes you feel after, and I love the way it makes you look after. Yeah. Um, it just makes you have a little bit more life going on, and it just pops. It like, makes you more positive. Yeah. Just more confident. More confident. Um, <laughs> And it's fun. It's like it is fun. It's an art. Yeah. Yeah. And you love to just try new things and put it on and see what works and you know, it's just everything. Yeah. You can't not love makeup. <laughs> Don't just copy. Um. <laughs> you can't just not love makeup. It's just amazing. So. Yeah. But All right. That was the last question. Yeah. 30 questions and we rocked it, I think. That was yeah. so much fun. So fun. You got to come over more so we could do more. Yeah, we will. Okay, cool. We'll do it. <laughs> yeah. But, um, um, so thank you guys for watching our video. You. And I hope you liked my special guest. Uh, <laughs> long time friend here. So um, stay tuned for more videos from both of us. And keep watching and subscribe. Subscribe. Don't forget. <laughs>